use my trip. Yeah, it's a can trip. It does 1d12 poison damage if the target fails a saving throw. Chris is already getting into character. <laughs> and you can <laughs> pickle orc heads with it. You can yeah, pickle orc heads yeah. with it. <laughs> Highly acidic poison. Ooh, that reminds me, I made pickles this week. That's a point. Can you, Alan? Can we get Alan a character on the board? Has he got a character? Who is he? No. <laughs> Are we on the board yet? Should I put? Should we put ourselves? Or I am, I you can. should be on the board. Yeah, you should be. Yeah. Oh, okay, I have to scroll over again. It keeps knocking I'm my frame. The oh, there I am. Sad NPC. I'll tell you what I'll do for now. What I'll do for now is I will put. Um, oh dear me! I'll put somebody on the board for Alan that he can, and then he can. <laughs> we know. Out. I cannot hear you, Eduardo. Me? Oh, there you are. I, I heard your voice in real life, but I couldn't hear you in the. <laughs> in the close some doors. Okay. This mm -hmm. going on for now. Are you two in separate rooms? Yeah. Cool. Yeah, he's in the kitchen and I'm in the in the room. My computers are stacked on top of each other. Oh, here it is. My, this is my new one. Hey. It's not in rotation yet. Yeah, like we don't have a lot of space, but if we do this, everyone can be in their computer. Mm. Okay, I put uh, I put an icon on for Alan when he gets here. Going to be some kind of melee person, or is that just a guess? <laughs> yeah, I have no idea what he's going to be. I just pulled, pulled out the first thing I saw, and he can work. Is out. he some kind of soul bender that can get, get souls into people's bodies? Because that, <laughs> that would be convenient. Oh, uh, yeah, that reminds me. I wanted to share a funny picture about the soul thing. Let me see if I can find it. Huh. Okay, so let's, let's, let's rock and roll, and Alan can catch up. Um, Alan is typing, okay. So I'm thinking. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. Alan's still typing. Still figuring out how to open via phone. Ha, 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 ha. <laughs> okay. Uh, should just use the audio channel. Right. Okay, so while Alan's figuring it out, we'll uh, decide what you guys are going to do. So, you had brutally and uh, brutally and, and callously just murdered some poor, innocent. He was not that innocent. He was poor, not innocent, but. Uh, so you brutally murdered this poor, innocent guy and stole his cart. And you opted, as I believe you thought, because, because NPC, Chris's character, has now had her st soul stolen and is in the bag. Who's carrying the bag, by the way? Fever. What yeah, level are you fever. guys here? Fever? Fever? Fever, you've got, the, uh, you've got the bag. I have the bag in one of my okay. mini pockets. What are you doing with the bag? I'm just keeping it. Didn't you steal a tiger's soul? Oh yeah, I have the tiger soul, but it's also in the bag with your soul and probably oh, other, souls. other souls. Kitty. Yes, an indeterminate number of other souls. Okay, and then that, that bag's kind of creeping you out a bit, I have to say, um, Faber, you know. Um, even even Faber, it's a bit like, it's like just on the edge of your hearing, you can hear like screams and kind of wails and, and sounds of tigers. <laughs> I'm going to try to imitate it while singing, while we're traveling, so I can unsettle everybody else, not just me. Maybe time for bagpipes, traveling bagpipes. I will never financially recover from this. <laughs> <laughs> I think a few people are singing that song right now. Okay, so what are you going to do? 
Oh, uh, DM, I still have the orb of something, right? Do you have that disruption orb? Yeah, yeah disruption orb. Care what it does. Well, I wonder what would happen if uh, we could take the soul of my favorite bartender out of the the bag. I say it out loud. Nothing. Oh, you're going to say, I wonder what would happen if I took the... Um, well, what happened? The bag sort of, you hear the like screaming get louder and it like kind of flatters around a bit, but unfortunately the soul doesn't yeah. come, come out. Okay. <laughs> thump, thump, thump. Let the souls out. So I'm just going to open like uh, towards nobody. No, 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 not, okay. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, like in a general direction. I think last the, week they decided with um, um, the sorcerer already tried that. Yeah, you decided the uh, the uh, the paladin cleanse had mm -hmm. sort of said, let's head off to Kenham and, and find a, a temple and a yeah. priest. To oh, yeah, sort it out. that's it. Yeah. yeah, we wanted to find another city that. and find that uh, some religion people of lavender, which you happen to know is going north and. Mm -hmm. East from here. Okay, so we can find the priest who knows a little about souls. Yep. Mm -hmm. And also to find maybe some more information because we cannot fight alone <laughs> against <laughs> the beautiful Marla. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So I tell you what I'm gonna do is you you're gonna proceed on up the road. I'm gonna move you to the next map. Dun, 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 dun. Let's see what happens. Have you arrived on the next map yet? Yep. Mm. It's still loading. In progress. It's okay. okay. Oh, I'll get hello. There. Okay. Okay, okay oh, you're down. Is it supposed to be all black? Yep. Oh, I see. Yeah, scroll down. You're just you're down in the, the corner. Bottom. Yeah, you're in the unknown territory. Unknown territory. Okay. <laughs> Where the GM doesn't want you to go. Yep. Ooh. I'm quite happy for you to go anywhere. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that creepy had, boy tells me everything. I had yeah, I had I had fun <laughs> this weekend passing the time um, making these maps. I got lots of maps. Uh, anyway, let's go, let's go back to Marlon. <laughs> let's go to the opposite way. <laughs> okay, so hold on a minute. I will use the where we are. The other. So as you, you're moving. Oh, we haven't got. I'm going to have to put the card on the. Uh, hold on a minute. I'm going to have to add the card in. Uh, where we at? Let's see. Let me get in here. Uh, What's that puddle of mud over there? Or puddle Maybe of blood? I should say. Maybe it's some kind of drowning pool. Must be blood or lava. How that? Take a drink and you will know. Oops, I didn't mean yeah. to do that. I'm in the wrong. I'm in the wrong. I'm in the wrong thing. Oops. <laughs> the floor <laughs> is lava. Okay. The now lava I need to go in here. I need to get in here. Let's see if that's gonna work. Ah, oh, that's gonna work. Okay. Keep. Seems like they had a landslide over here. Yeah. Oh, Actually. Actually, if you want to know what happened, um, a middle-aged man with some pen and ink and a straw started mucking about <laughs> and, and blowing, like getting back into his childhood. And uh, there you go. There's your cart back. Right, and uh, back and I, was, I was messing around with pen and inks and fun and scanners and things. Hey, okay. horse, why the long face? So I guess we continue north, but I want to keep an eye around us. Okay. Well, up ahead, you can see a wood. There's nothing bad going to happen in the woods. That tree uh, is really? leaking blood. That's where good things happen. I think that's not a good sign. Yeah, the, the mm. tree is bleeding over there. Good eye. Unless it's Ooh, lava. Bleeding tree. What if it's a tree bleeding lava? That would be fancy. Not the lava trees. No. <laughs> they haunt you Everything with the deeper depths of your soul. Uh, okay. You have a soul, so you cannot be haunted by it, technically. I guess let's keep to the road. 
Do we know that this road is going to take us to the place we want to go? Or you want to go to Kenneman? Yeah, you probably um, you probably know enough about the uh, you know you've got enough general knowledge of the area to know roughly where you want to be. I'm still in the wrong thing. Here we go. That's the one. See if Alan. I'll change it when he tells me what. So the horse steps on the trap. What happens? <laughs> so you send the, are you in the cart or are you just sending the horse off ahead? Yeah, I'm in the cart, sure. You're in the cart? Be in the cart. I'm in the car. Get in the car, Morty. <laughs> well, you just see the roads either going up ahead. This is quite a large scale map, by the way. So you've traveled oh, quite a long time. Yeah, and it's it's now it's probably getting to nightfall by now. Yeah, yeah. This is a this is a yeah. This okay. is like uh, oh, you know, miles, eh? Okay. And we're in miles here, mate. So you've been trotting along on the road for a few hours and getting to <laughs> nightfall. Yeah, we should probably. Yeah, twelve miles is good enough. Good job, guys. Let's take a rest. Yeah. Let's sleep. Let's take a rest around this district to get some cover. You're just okay, going to take the really middle of the road. Tall. Somebody comes they in, they can find us easily. So you guys okay. are just going to randomly stop your cart in the middle of the road to take a long rest, Sure. Huh? No. <laughs> no, I'm going to walk one mile into the distance. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Um, and still be right here. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, yeah, somewhere on the side. Yeah, I think a little in the side, behind the trees. Like yeah. Little. Yeah. Okay. okay. That's so we of can course. hide the cart a little. Yeah. Let the horse rest. So you hide in the cart. Sure. How are you going to hide the cart? Not. I like put some. Hide leaves oh. and some, something behind like a, a a tree so it's not easily seen like kind of camouflage yeah we cut a few, few trees have you ever like you know, actually been on a horse and cart mm. uh -huh. yes like oh, in real see. life or <laughs> yeah in real life oh, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. Yeah, a, a few times yeah like i my brother used to keep horses yeah, they're not very cooperative, you know. You sort of get off the road and it's like, <laughs> and it'll just get stuck in like mud and things like mm. that. So I think someone is going to have to roll me animal handling. That would be MPC. What if I just burn the whole thing? No. <laughs> we needed to travel tomorrow, come on. Yeah, we need to stop there running. There we go. Running. We'll oh, cross that bridge tomorrow. Good. 22 to animal handling. Mm. Oh, very good. You just, you, you lead the horse off beautifully the heart the cart comes with you without any hitch it's yeah you, you put it just where you want it next to the tree good horse <laughs> <laughs> and what else what are you gonna do it's nightfall it's dark it's spooky uh, let's spooky. take turns to take a look to are we gonna build a fire and we get ready. Or we just sleep inside the cart. Yeah, we can sleep inside the cart. But someone need to we need to take turns to keep an eye out. Yeah, we can do that. Yeah. Okay. Who wants to take the first one? I mean I can trance. Yeah, so, you can, oh, yeah. The, the elves can trans and we yeah, can we just can trans for let four go. Hours. So we have two yes. elves. That's eight hours. Yeah. yeah. Cool. I can sleep for an hour straight. Well, I can transfer. Really All right, cool. Have okay. fun. Um, keep an eye out, girls. So did you light a fire? <laughs> did we? Um, Do we need a fire? No, not really. Yeah. <laughs> It's better just to be a little hidden. I mean, it's, it's, it's summer, dark. right? Nights are warm. Um, it's getting a bit chilly. Ah, then let's light a fire. You just want to do fire. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> let, let the woman do her fire. I mean, I'm okay, cold. You can make, you can make Here fire. you go. Here's the fire. 
Okay, yeah, putting somebody on watch. NPC is trancing. Uh-huh. Oh, you got a fire. Oh. <laughs> Something. Hey, that's oh, we got a fire. Free fire. <laughs> yep. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, so NPC is going to transfer the first four hours. And then, four hours. And then Lena. It's going to be good. <laughs> so Lena is on watch first. Uh, am okay. I on first watch? Okay. Uh, trancing, I guess, isn't the same as watch. It's just it's a rest. Yeah, it's just kind of a sleeping. Kind of. I mean, we are still conscious. So. Yeah, so we could technically trance at the same time, but it's better to stagger. The one who's awake is on watch, I guess. Okay. Uh -huh. Okay, let's do that. Okay, if you need anything, well, just I'm let it go. My fire. If you need anything, just uh, go with cleanse because I'm going to be sleeping and I don't want to be bothered. Oh, you like, will if know if there's something going bad. If there's cranium rats or stinky people, just kill them. Just, just it's all you have to do. You don't have to wake me up. Okay. I'm going to go to sleep. You can wake me up. Don't worry, girls. Okay. I guess if you're dying, maybe. But you better be dying. Okay, so who's on watch? I am, I guess. Okay. What's your passive perception? Not good. <laughs> <laughs> Check it out. Hmm? Yeah, don't, don't even worry about it. Well, it's actually 13. Wow. Okay. That's active. The passive is just your wisdom plus 10. Yeah, yeah. 13. Unless... Do you want me to make an active one? No, just your passive one because you're not telling me what you're doing while you're on watch. Yeah, no, I'm just... <laughs> what you're doing while Feed. you're on watch. I'm just feeding the like... fire. Yeah, so you're staring moodily into the fire. Yep. Yeah, that's a really good idea in my on your own watch. Stare into the brightest area. Like, I'm trying to the... divine our path in the, the future in the campfire. Uh, Are your masters are not going to come at us. Yeah, I'm doing some campfire divination. Uh, so this... <laughs> this uh, female sort of slim female figure with kind of branches and leaves sort of where she should have hair and, and things steps out you see a sort of um kind of trying to kind of avoid being seen but even while you're staring into that fire you sort of catch a glimpse of her sort of moving through the trees hi hey Faye. <laughs> so in, in order to get this kind of she's probably quite close to you so we're yeah. gonna have to pretend that these aren't really miles but Mm -hmm. Let's pretend that we're about here. Um, nice hair. What language? Oh, you speak Elvish, don't you? Sure. Uh, roll me a really easy, like, nature check or something. Ooh, to know what this is? Okay. Yep. Nature check, you say. Mm -mm. Oh, 16. You recognize that this is a dryad. And she's kind of looking at the fire like she's not a happy dryad. Yeah, oh. figured. <laughs> is this your forest? Are you saying that in Elvish? Yeah. It's not Perfect. my Perfect. forest. This is our forest. Yeah, our forest. Yes, our forest. Yeah, our forest. No, not your forest. <laughs> our forest. Oh. Um, how many of you? She sort of looks at the trees. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Many. So, yeah. Hello. Oh, hey. Hi. Alan. Oh, funny. Hey, Alan. <laughs> oh, double just, speak. Just the right time. I'm about to uh, pick, pick a fight with the dryad. Good thing we're not in a forest. Great idea. At level yeah, five. Yeah, exactly. Um, 
Alan, I, I've assigned this red guy to you. Yep, I've emailed you my character I just made. I'm totally not on the spot. Just now. Okay, fine. <laughs> Is it a bard? No. <laughs> Do you want me to make a bard? No. <laughs> <laughs> it would be so much fun having two bards. Yeah. I finally can learn a second song. I didn't know, yeah. know what we had, so I chose the most generic thing we had. You can have a, you can do that difficult yeah. second album. <laughs> so what? What's your name, lady, miss, missus? Oh, by the way, while you're saying that, you, you noticed that there was a guy asleep in the in the cart. It's <laughs> 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 like you hadn't noticed him before. He was somebody stuck in our cart while I was on watch. I've already had to fix up this this thing on the app. <laughs> uh, Doesn't let you copy? open up URLs. Yeah, what my copy paste recently is just not working. I can't do it on there. So anyway, um, the Dreads like you know she's like put out the fire. Oh, I thought you we came here because you were cold. Well. I cannot snuff out fires, can you? We can snuff Only out. Only you can stop forest fires. Yep. <laughs> are you are you smoking the dryad? Yeah, I'm smoking the dryad. I'm smoking the I'm stretching out a red, okay, mountain dwarf fighter, okay, we've got a mountain dwarf fighter oh. who was asleep in the car, mm -hmm. he's okay. just woken up, but anyway, the uh, the dryad's like, you should really put out that fire. Yeah, I would if I could, but I have no water. Well, stamp on it. Alright, I'll try to stamp on it. <laughs> Oh, I know. Fight fire with fire. I'll cast Firebolt <laughs> at the fi at the campfire. <laughs> That's probably gonna work. Yeah. Yeah, I mean... If I this campaign away, isn't gonna last very long, is it? Does this motion wake us up? No, there are two threads. Um, two, <laughs> yeah, another one steps out and they're like... It's an elf. Think it's a bad mm hmm uh, are, are we uh, asleep? Guys, uh, guys, okay. I have some issues with the forest ladies. What Clans? Clans? Not you. Cyber, you can sleep. Clans? Okay. 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 What's going on? I don't know. What's happening? No the ladies there. said that I should put out the fire. Oh, these are traits. Yeah, I think you should put out the fire. Yeah, but how? Uh, with dirt. Let's put some like so, like dirt on it. Okay. Rocks and like maybe some dirt from the road. You have a shovel. Yeah, we will just like I can use a little of my my axe to <laughs> to okay. like a shovel. And the embers start like. Flying around the place, and the trains are like, "What are you doing? Are you trying to burn the forest?" No, no, we're trying to put the fire out, but we don't have water. East Tree Sisters, they are trying to put out the fire. They kind of look at you with kind of like a certain amount of concern. They look at an NPC with a certain amount of concern. Mm -hmm. And they sort of quail back a bit, like kind of go back a bit and they're like, soulless, soulless. Yeah, these things happen. <laughs> you are By so any nice. chance, uh, I talked to the Druids. By any chance, do you know how to get the soul back to someone? Well, he might know. Oh. And they kind of just. Uh, up this, uh, up uh, this, uh, hold on a minute, where we at? That's not suspicious at all. <laughs> this the way. pronoun game is always legit. <laughs> you might know. So who is he? Who, who knows this? 
soul thingy? Well, it's the master. It's not Marlo, isn't he? <laughs> it's not Marlo, someone called Marlo, Pilador of Pentacles? No, he's called oh. the master. Okay, okay, that, that's good. Because everything is about Marlo <laughs> lately. <laughs> Can you tell us a little more about that? We're trying to look for someone to get her soul back. Well, there's the master who knows everything. Huh? And then there are his servants. Hmm. I thought that druids are, were usually the servants of the forest. Dreads, not druids, dreads. Ah, dreads. D R Y A D. Yeah, I, I, was I, was thinking, I was thinking. I was thinking about that word, but my pronunciation was going to the other side. Sorry. Okay, yeah. the dreid and the druid. Yeah, right. yeah. I thought the, dreids were like the servants of the forest. The forest, not like following a master. But the master is the master of the forest. Oh. Maybe the master is a druid. <laughs> All right. Take us to your leader. After we had a sleep. Can you I watch over us so. while we sleep? I can't do the whole fires. I'm sorry. No. Charisma, your charisma. I, can, I can ask them. I, I can make a charisma check if okay, you want. Okay, you do. Okay. Oh. Uh, it would be a... Saving? No. Where, where did I put Straight it? charisma. Ah, here. Oh, got it. <laughs> 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 the tiefling is kind of made of fire. Yeah, I think I'm a fire kind of related tiefling. Maybe it's not the best that I talk about it. It's like a termite <laughs> telling you your house is in good hands. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, these two trades, they're like, we won't watch over you. And if you come, you must come now. Uh, come now. Okay. Uh, any insight? Very well. Insight check. Okay. Do they look like they're going to kill us? <laughs> Do they look like they're going to kill you? No. Why? Uh, yeah. That's great. Bro. You know what? You're terrified of these two wooden <laughs> <laughs> dragons. <laughs> kind of skinny. I'm not sleep. Sorry. Silk like. I was so tired and you haven't let me sleep, so. <sighs> And what is that in the card? Is that a person? Oh yeah, there's this dwarf what? in the card. Alan? Yes. Your dwarf was like, he's a fighter, yeah? Yes. Yeah, he was just like, you know, wandering along on his normal adventures and he saw this convenient cart going by, so he hopped on the back to get a lift, fell asleep. <laughs> and then he woke up and he's surrounded by crazy people I'd say you're crazy <laughs> for sneaking Hello. into our cart <laughs> do your mind I'm trying to sleep here who are you are you with Marlo I'm, I'm Red is it Marlo Red yes yeah. Red are I'm you part red. of Marlo's crew <laughs> What was that, laddie? Uh, are you part of Marlo's group? Uh, you don't know anything about Marlo. You're just some like random dwarf adventurer. You've never, well, you might have heard of him. He's some kind of weird guy that runs the magic shop. That's about as much as you know. <laughs> and that, no, no, laddie. Oh. Um, she's a she, by the way. She's a Wait, she. Yeah, oh. less. Oh, Lena. No, I mean, uh, I guess he's talking to uh, Clance. Oh, yeah. yeah. Yeah, Clance is a girl. Clance. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, last day. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So can I, can I, I don't want to make another inside check because I think it's going to be. <laughs> <laughs> but do I trust him when he says he doesn't know Marla? Um, 
Well, I have a score of, um, you know what? I'll cast Zone of Truth. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Do your charisma saving for them. Okay, you cast Zone of Truth. Where do you cast it? Well, so that our dwarf and friend is in it. Okay. Wait, you what can mean? cast Zone of Truth too? Yeah, I have a scroll. Oh, oh. that's right. I, I oh, have it too. Yeah. As a no, that's, that's, like, that's like a one use only scroll up, by yeah, the way. Yeah, that's fine. Good use. You're probably not going to need it anymore. Yeah, we have clans. Well, Alan, doesn't put you on the spot, mate. You've now got to tell the truth. <laughs> oh, you <laughs> need to make what the was it? Yeah, well, I say it was like a wisdom 17 or something, isn't it? That's, that's <laughs> yeah. charisma. Charisma 17 or wisdom 17. Charisma 17. Yeah, do a save. <laughs> yeah, this well, is a one with no magic. magic yeah. Sure. Oh, wait. Oh, I have to create it on, on here, don't I? You can make the straight roll. With, with you, if you have yeah. like D&D Beyond or something, you can yeah, just I got D&D Beyond whatever. right here. So I just have to make a straight sing, wisdom yeah. saving throw. Yep. Yeah. yep. I yeah. think it's charisma. Uh, charisma. I got a twelve plus a one, thirteen. So you uh-huh. fail. Yeah, I failed. <laughs> you need to say the truth. All right. Now you have to tell the truth. Oh no. Are you sure you don't know Marlo? <laughs> You don't know Marlo. I don't know no Marlo, the the magic shop guy. Oh, so you know him? <laughs> yeah, <it is. laughs> I know of him. <laughs> All right. Oh, you know of him. Hmm. You know the kind of, the reason shop. you know of him, Alan, is because he's the only guy that managed to keep his magic shop going over the last few years because there's been this like time when like people were assassinating magicians, magic users, owners of magic shops, and people used to hang out outside like the shops that sold components and then just like murder the wizards when they came out. <laughs> so like everybody like knows that, that Marlow was the only guy that was able to keep his shop going through all of this like terrible purge. Yeah, he's got more than lad. Yeah. His shop going for the longest time. Right. Okay. So, what, what were you doing in this car? This was Marlo's man car. Well, I was just walking, and then I felt tired, felt good shade, went to sleep, and then you guys woke me up. Hmm. What is your intention? What are you doing? Like in your life in general? Have you met Latander? Oh God, that's fun. <laughs> Sorry. Have you met the God Latander? He, he can guide you if you don't have a way to go. I don't know no god yet, but sure. Okay, here's a pamphlet. You can <laughs> read about other experiences of different people who have like find the light, and they can be revert, revert from the light of Latander. You just need to die, but yeah, that's a small sacrifice. That sounds great. Do I know how to read? I do know how to read. I've got ten plus minus zero. <laughs> Fine. Worry, I can read it to you. <laughs> I can read it to you and I can make the voices. Yeah, she will preach all day about Latenda. <laughs> mm. Okay, but I think we have another thing that we need to do first. Yeah. Hey, Dryads, would you mind coming a bit closer to us? Maybe inside the zone of truth? <laughs> How big is the zone of truth? I think. Are it's... you saying that to them? I mean, <laughs> they're quite far, so I guess. Well, how Are you going to like, try oh, and right. persuade them? Just roll me a persuasion check then. Okay. Please, no natural one. Yeah, it's going to be a natural one, you know it. We're going to have to fight these guys. Uh, persuasion. We have a lot of fires. Uh, yeah, they already hate me though. Ah, look at that. Dirty okay. 20. Oof. Ooh. You have plus 15 to persuasion? What? No. Ah, plus five. <laughs> oh, five. sorry, I misread that. <laughs> plus 15. <laughs> oh, wow. You know, they <laughs> nearly they nearly fell for it. They nearly stepped nearly. forward. Uh, but they rolled a 19 plus uh, charisma, yeah. which is good, good, good. which is four. So they actually narrowly resisted you. But you saw them stepping towards it and then catch themselves. Uh, and like, it was a good no, thing. why don't you step into the zone of truth? 
Oh, you have it as well? Okay. No, 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 your zone of truth. Step into oh. your own zone of truth. We saw you read the scroll. Yeah. Why don't we step together? <laughs> <laughs> and you know what? They roll the one. They're like, <laughs> for some weird reason, this soulless, this soulless person is so persuasive. Is so persuasive. They just like, they like just step into the zone of truth. They're like, with standing around the door, they're like, oh, it's a dwarf. He's <laughs> 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 a dryad. Uh, by the way, what's your name, dwarf? Red. I mean, I know what you're wearing, but what's your name? His name's Red. <laughs> ah. <laughs> I Are you virgin? Something witty. I couldn't figure it out. Hello, Red. <laughs> My name is MPC. NPC? MPC. Oh, MPC. Don't let the name Person. mislead you. I'm actually a player. <laughs> well, Damn, you almost had me. Actually, she was she very lively soul. before her soul got sucked out by this bag, it by the happens. way. It happens. I tried. I've been a bartender long enough. I know what it's like to work a long shift. It is hard, it is hard. Okay, <laughs> so we have the the droids inside the circle. Yeah, hey droids, are you gonna backstab us? We wouldn't do such a thing. We are the protectors of the forest. Who is he? Why, Master Oakley. Oakley? Does he? Will he or you harm us in any way if we are polite? Um, we have no intention of harming any living creature that respects the forest. We're doomed. <laughs> it's the dawn of the truth. Yeah, if they look at you and they go, Yes, you probably are. MP calls him like she sees him. <laughs> Sorry, I broke character. <laughs> okay, well, no, no, I guess... we, we really, yes, we you, do do look, you do look doomed. You have no soul. Where is your soul? That is a question. In this bag. That... Oh, yeah, it's in the bag. But we cannot take it out. Which We're bag? looking for a way. Which bag? Deeper still asleep. Ah uh, yeah, let, let, let's Which wake up <laughs> Timer. Fuck off. Timer, I like up. it, I like it. Fuck off. Wake up. Wait, it's fart. like Deeper's in the zone of truth, actually. Every everyone but the paladin is in the zone of truth now. <laughs> I think so. So I have to make a saving throw. <laughs> I'm going to say the same thing. Fuck off. <laughs> he really means it. Hmm. I figured as much. The, which bag? What is this bag of which you speak? The bard has it. I'll go grab the bag from him. The bard, we love music. Fuck off. Hey, bard, they, <laughs> they want to hear your... Your amazing wait, odes wait, and music. Wait, 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 they want to hear a song? You yeah, should have song. started on. with that one. And I bring out... Oh, we have a book. Yes, you can because play a song. You can be dancing around the circle. Wait, oh. is this going to take like a really long time? Why? Oh, I have a lute. They're really... Because I only know one song. <laughs> no! <laughs> one song. So I'm going to go on the top of the cart and bring out my lute and I start singing my song, the song about the sailor who had too much to drink and now needs to relieve himself with a woman. Okay. <laughs> what language is this song in? Oh, it's a little bit common, a little bit halfling. Okay. You know, that's why I want to sing it. Okay. I'll translate the lyrics into Elvish. For them. Can you roll me a performance check? Then I'm amazing for it. They're kind of like tapping their feet along and they're like, wow, I don't know what this song's about, but it's really good. They're saying in Elvish. 
<laughs> yeah, you want to come with us to the circle and sing your song and we can all dance around in the moonlight naked. I'm really into that. Yeah. <laughs> I also have bagpipes if you <laughs> want to hear the same song, but in bagpipes. And I bring out my bagpipes and start playing the same song, but <laughs> now in bagpipes. We have now disrespected the forest. <laughs> <laughs> They're like the the, the the dreads, they do the sort of, you know, sort of flitting through the trees and beckoning act. Come with us, come with Let's us. Let's go. Okay. Come with us, come with us. I wonder if it's a teleportation circle. I don't know. Come with us, come with us. And they're just like vanishing up up the road. Like, come oh, with us, come wait. with us. Let me get the horse. Yep. Yeah, the horse is there. I'm just playing on, on the cart, like, not helping. Where's my. I'm still in the cart. <laughs> <laughs> at one moment, I look at you the and be like, hey, who the no fuck is this guy? The cart, by the way. Okay, Come so on, okay. Wait, are we okay. taking are we taking the cart? Yeah. I suppose with, because it's a heck of a way, you know, this is like is one miles. of these squares is miles, so like is it one of these squares? We can still sleep for us then. I think so. Someone could sleep in the cart. We're gonna My cart. be playing music all night. Technically it's our cart. We stole it fair and square. I already marked it. Yeah. We, MP also did this. I'm gonna start <laughs> peeing on the cart. Yeah, I'm marking it as well. So <laughs> you have to lick it, not pee on it. Uh, I mark things by peeing. I don't know what your savage ways are. <laughs> I'm more traditional. M MP used a small knife and carved her initials. I'm looking at you with disapproval. Like all of you in general. <laughs> so you're a paladin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's just what a paladin does. It's like ninety yeah, percent of their of job. Role, you know. <laughs> playing is so easy when you're a paladin. Hey, the card ran away. Hey, where is the card going? <laughs> Someone is a red. The no. card. Why can't I control the card? Everyone can. <laughs> hey, put the card. Oh, everyone can. <laughs> hey, this is right. Let's go to this circle. Oh, Stonehenge. Look at that. Oh. Hey. Is that where we're going to be dancing at? Yep. And I'm just playing the same song for like the fifth or tenth time. <laughs> I'm trying yeah, to they're... sleep. Shut up. They've got wood for Shut brains. Up. They it's got wood for brains. End. They don't care. So, like, it's really <laughs> like it's the middle of the night and you arrive at this. Uh, circle and you see these two guys that are obviously druids and the dreads and you see them all back and they said look we've got worshippers they, they're gonna dance in a circle naked i'm a performer Yay. Yes. are we getting paid <laughs> <laughs> they they don't understand the concept paid the hippies they don't understand money. <laughs> Do you have booze? <laughs> magic items, maybe? The magic is in the circle. Let's dance. Play your music. Okay. Why do you want alcohol. us to dance in the circle? Do I, so do I get it... a default booze barrel as a dwarf? Oh. Red, you should think probably you get dance a in the circle. Of barrels. <laughs> I'm didn't we stick burn everything in the cart? We didn't find anything in the cart, I think. No, you oh, took it all out and you burnt it, if you remember. Oh, yeah. Red, who was asleep under was a blanket. Like, <laughs> How did we miss burning a dwarf? I don't know, but yeah, we did. <laughs> <laughs> you are alive by luck. Okay, so, the, so you, you come up to the circle and you see there's this, yeah, this dolman and then this circle around it and the druids are kind of looking at you expectantly and they're standing there like old hippies like totally naked everything dangling in the breeze i'm taking my pants off and walking <laughs> away with the, the backpacks <laughs> they're like looking at you expectantly uh and i'm gonna play 
the same okay. time. <laughs> <laughs> With the bagpipes. With the bagpipes, yeah. Okay. Bieber, Nickelback. Well, I'm not going to get into the circle because I cannot be worshipping another god that is not my god. And the tray is the kind of looking at you and they're going like, come into the circle, take off that awful armor and dance. You Why do you want us to dance in the circle? So we can summon the master. Ooh. <laughs> uh, okay. Very well. And the jury is... a perception check on the area of the circle. It doesn't look seem bloody or anything. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> Any noticeable sacrificial marks? You go ahead. Why the hell do we have a smart character? <laughs> 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 We're not used to that. <laughs> Okay, go ahead. Uh, I got a, a nine. Well, you kind of looking around, it looks pretty well trodden. And, take that back. Yeah, you know, maybe, you know. <laughs> yeah, there may have been blood spilt here, here and there, you know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm going back in the car. <laughs> yeah. Hold on, MP has some soulless business to attend to. Yeah, they kind of look at you and they speak and they... <laughs> The druids kind of look at you, and uh, they're like, you have no soul. Yeah, I know. I'll be back in 10 minutes. Sorry. Real life calls. Okay. <laughs> yeah, she doesn't have a soul. I mean, we have it in a bag, but we don't know how to put it back. Do you have any idea what we can do? <laughs> They 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 look at you and they're like, what bag? Yeah. Uh, Tiber, can I see the bag? I'm giving you the finger where I'm playing the bagpipes, and I'm showing you like a pocket. Okay, my bag. I am going to take the bag. And you get a handful of butt <laughs> of halfling butt. Yeah, got to bear in mind this bard is naked except for a pair of bad pipes. I'm, I'm not sure how uh, uh, Ben spills the pipe pad. <laughs> <laughs> sure it goes up gingerly like I'm taking the bag. I, I imagine that the bag looks like this. It's the, the bag, bag of souls. souls. <laughs> okay. And then... It should be with my belongings, I think. I just like, kind of point at them and keep okay, them dancing. I look between his things and I'll grab the bag. This bag. One of them looks at it and he's like, it's a bag. And one of them looks at it and his face sort of goes white. Look inside. Do you, do you know what is it? <laughs> oh, look inside. No. Did you just say, <laughs> did you just no. say is, that, is that a persuasion? No, I have the bag with <laughs> me and I, I'm not going to let them open it. The guy, one of them, like the one, one of them, just starts to look towards the bag like an idiot, and the other one's like, grabs it, like, "Don't look in the bag." No, no, don't look in the bag. It's going to take your soul, like it did with our friend. Do you know what is this? I asked to the guy that seems to know. I can hear the soul screaming. Yeah, we don't know what to do with the souls in here. Well. We could summon the master. Uh -huh. He might know. Okay, what do you need to summon him? We need a soul to dance naked around in a circle and sing this wonderful song that the little man's playing. Does it work with any song? Fun? Does it work with any song? It works if the song is. Honest and truthful. Oh, I am. It's not going to work. <laughs> All right. I joined the circle naked because I do want to get my bartender back. Okay. Okay, I, I don't join. You don't join. They're like, yeah. hey, you're shy. You're shy. <laughs> mm. It would be a sin to worship another god. Okay. It's not a god, it's a master. They look at the dwarf. Where's the dwarf? He's in the cup. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be shy, little hairy man. Hairy man. Is there a bruise there? 
take off that. You wearing armor, I assume? Are you wearing armor? I am wearing. Oh, I have no idea, actually. I'm a class 11. No, you're not wearing chainmail. Yes, apparently. Oh, you've got chain. You've got chainmail on. Then I take off that heavy iron. Dance in the circle. Come on, it's going to be fun. I They're not down very persuasive. Then. They're kind of persuasive. <laughs> They're kind of persuasive. You're tempted. Tempted. Yeah. I'll see where this goes on. Okay, so Bard, can you roll me another performance check? Sure. No. Nice. <laughs> it's getting a little worse. <laughs> it's hard to be walking and playing the bagpipes at the same time. Have you ever tried? <laughs> it's just like that kind oh, of. It's a little bit chilly, so like can get the pool. <laughs> yeah, your fingers are cold. It's always hard to play in the cold, isn't it? Yeah, your fingers are stiff. You're like, oh. oh. I'm afraid it's just not happening. Drinkers. You find yourself like stomping around naked and on the top of a hill in the middle of nowhere and with a couple of dryads and a couple of naked old men and uh, it's just not happening. Does anybody want to join me playing the loot? Does anybody know how to play the loot? Sure, give me the loot. Here's the loot. Well, okay. in between my belongings, I'm naked. Right now, so. That's fine. I'm naked too. Don't be weird. <laughs> All right. You're making this weird, not me. Here's my performance check with the loot I've never played before. Okay. <laughs> Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> I'm a natural. Marina stops playing Stairway to Heaven. <laughs> <laughs> and they start swaying gently. <laughs> Uh -oh. dun, 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 dun. Is there anything happening with the summoning circle? Uh, well, Hi. over on the, the hill by the blasted oak, you see this uh, That's a moose. unearthly fey creature on this massive stag just like dramatically silhouetted against the uh, the, the setting moon and it looks kind of like kind of impressive Ooh, i'm back and impressed threateningly impressive or just moving well moves? well that depends that really on roll. depends <laughs> on uh, you guys like you know, like, how do you feel about fey creatures in the moonlight, in the dark, is he when you're naked? Naked and dancing? No, he's most definitely not naked and dancing. He's dressed, <laughs> oh, <yeah. laughs> uh, carrying a long whip. Kinky. Yep. Can I do my usual to check if he's got like a nibble? Killing. You can do a check, yes. Yeah, I'm going to do maybe divine sense. I'm keeping the loot, by the way. Okay. <laughs> you're going to be losing something. Else. <laughs> and as you're doing that, it starts approaching you guys in the circle. So can I feel if it's good and evil? Um, you don't feel it is neither good nor evil. Oh. You you feel it is neither good nor evil. It is <coughs> very natural. Okay. Okay. And it just starts the master of the forest. <laughs> <laughs> and he looks at you and he goes, "Bloody hell! <laughs> You've got no skull." <laughs> I've been told. Oh, where's your soul? I in don't bag. know. It's in this bag. We have it here. And he kind of looks at you with these blazing eyes and says, In the bag? Yes. What else is in the bag? I get many souls in the bag. There's a lot of Take souls a look. in here. Take Let's a look. 
Oh no, let's let them all out in the circle and see what happens. No, the problem is if anyone, anyone that opens the bag is going to take to be it's all taken from them. So we cannot just open it. It's going to take your soul too. Yeah, the bag sucks your soul, man. Yeah, the bag sucks. Hey, can you? But if we open the bag, we can release all the souls. Yeah, we already tried that. Oh, that's what yeah. it didn't work. So you want to try? You can be my guest. Can I have the bag? No, we uh, need the soul. My you soul. like hold out his hand. Give me the bag. Can you get my soul back? Don't Hello. give him the bag. Can I do an insight? I can let your soul out. Will, will that help? Um, oh. I don't know. Mm. I think we should do it in the circle. Yes. Yeah, then this oh, bag yeah let's, let's do it in the circle. Woo! So so <laughs> oh, damn. <laughs> insight. What are you insighting? 21 natural 20 oh i want to know if he's gonna try to steal my soul um everyone, I soul. everyone wants your soul you don't know if he's going to try and see your, steal your soul you know he's like um he'd probably want to release your soul will that bring it back to me do i feel like he's going to return it i mean um no you feel like this is a totally chaotic creature who is just gonna do things on the fly and see what happens uh, good thing my soul is gone otherwise i would roll with that <laughs> i don't think we can trust mr head no. spike horseman i don't think so either so no so sorry, are those I'm heads on spikes does he have heads on spikes he has heads on spikes yeah no uh look they were bad people that's going to be a no from me, dog. Sorry. <laughs> it's like, look, you can put the bag in the circle. We can lay down the lady. We can open the bag in the circle and see what happens. I don't think it will. We can be have there. strong magic to keep whatever comes out of this bag within the circle. Mm, I'm on to him. I don't trust him. <laughs> Sorry, but it's her soul, so she gets to decide. Hmm? My soul, my choice. Yes. It's, it's her choice because it's, it's about her soul. So it's whatever she says. It's your choice. It's your choice. Yes, it is. And I choose Lion no. Of I don't think circle. you're a soul expert. I think you just want to play with it. <laughs> you see, like the, uh, like uh, this guy sort of expectantly sharpening this knife. <laughs> hey, what's that over there? Why is that um, sharpening whoops, a knife? Whoops. <laughs> so yeah, I just do can... his back. Thank you for your time, Master Ozak, but. He said, well, where are you going? We so must see a piece of... Uh, <laughs> sorry. We must see a priest of Lothander. He sort of shudders a bit at the name of Lothander. Oh, yeah, that boring old fart. Uh, I take my axe out. Oh, yes. <laughs> it's getting crazy and I'm naked. Oh, no. <laughs> I just have it out. I, I'm not doing anything with it. I'm just having it out. Yet. I'm just waiting to see what's going on. He says, well, he says, and he makes this big expansive gesture, which is to the, um, the northeast. And he says, the fastest way to the priest of Lathander. And he just points you off. Um, uh, just a minute, please. Which one of these do I want? There's another one. This one. Yeah, no. This one. It's this one in it. He sort of points you off in this direction. 
Mm-hmm. He says that's the quick this way, this oops, this way. Mm-hmm. He says that's the fastest way to the priest of Lathander. But surely you can rest in the cottage. Oh, surely this can't be a trap. <laughs> you don't. And he starts like kind of making his way back up to this old blasted oak. Mm-hmm. The guy like down here, he's still like sharpening his knife, expecting to be like looking at you. <laughs> we should probably not stay in the cottage either. Yeah, <laughs> I'll leave okay, it to a group appreciate. Uh, you, you I like these guys. We nice should stay host. here. Yeah, I like it too. It's pretty fun. Like you, you know how to have a party with naked people. Maybe he's around. just sharpening those knives for cooking. <clears throat> but I think we need to get going. All right, I let's vote. Let's do a group right. vote. Who wants to stay and who wants to go? I go for a stay. stay. What? I went for a stay. Wait, did Oops. Pete, did Cleanse just vote for stay? No. Oh, I vote. MP votes for go. These oh. people are useless. Okay. What about you, Red? I'm already in the cart. Yeah. <laughs> and that settles okay, it. Right. Three against two. So we have three against two. Let's go. So we're going to get moving. I imagine we have to drag Lena and Faber. Yeah. Uh, I'm, still dancing. I'm not going to put on pants. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to put on pants to come with us, Faber. Is that a proposition of something? No. <laughs> it would be nice if you're Wait, wearing pants. I believe okay. you. Where's the card? Oh, there it is. Okay. <laughs> now I'm driving it. Okay, you Wait, can drive it. Wait, Paladin is pro pants? <laughs> Ugh, why couldn't we have a priest of Moander? Oh, wait, <laughs> Moander. he's dead. <laughs> no. Okay, so thank you very much for the party. It was very nice. Thanks for the alcohol. They did, they did they, you like to drink? <laughs> you see their eyes brighten up, the two druids. Like, you want to have a drink? And they pull out this, like, stone bowl. You want to have All a right, drink? I'm out of cup. <laughs> 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 I'm walking towards the Hello. Sacrifice the <laughs> Red, we hardly knew ye. <laughs> <laughs> So they like hand you this bowl full of this bubbling like berry juice like liquid. You don't quite know Ooh. what's in there. Cool. Can I inside it? Hmm? You want to inside I, the uh, bottle? Perception, sorry? Perception or inside? Um, you can do a perception, yeah. Oh, I rolled great. That's a f- plus four. So That's seven. <laughs> Damn, that looks like a nice pint of beer. What could possibly go wrong with drinking that? Chug, 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 chug. I scoop it up. Chug, yep. chug, chug, chug. Give it a sip. Yep. How is it? Uh, can you roll me a constitution save? <laughs> <laughs> Great. Uh, that is a 17. Whoa. You're like, oh, that's all right. Tastes a bit sweet. Um, for, for, a brief moment, it, for a brief moment, you had this urge to like strip off your chain mail again and dance around the circle naked, but <laughs> subside. That's how I go to sleep usually. <laughs> <laughs> they offer the rest of you a drink. Oh, the dwarf likes it. And leave some for me. I'll take a sip. Okay, constitution. Alright. Can't save, huh? That's my fourth day. Oh, you have so much. <laughs> yes, what happens? I think I'm gonna be the next one, so just do mine. I go back to the circle and dance. In your dancing around, like Lena's just dancing around yep. really, like, drunkenly. Yep. And I'll Come join down. them. Take a drink, fail, and join them. 
Okay, so they start, as you guys are drinking, um, the dryads start like kind of beckoning you towards oh. the hill. And uh, you just so there's like. There's no alcohol in front of me, right? Yeah, and they just. Now I'm moving. The druids start walking over to the hill with the, with the booze as well. And they're like, come on, come to the hill. All right. That uh, seems really like a bad like a idea, try. my best customer. Yeah, yeah, this doesn't sound good. I know, but the wine is so good, or whatever is in this bottle. Wait. And the music, whoever's playing, is so good. And I can't yeah, just play. try it. Drink, maybe that will get your soul back. Sounds... No, I cannot yeah. drink until I get my soul back. Yeah. I don't want to fill up with the wrong spirits. <laughs> 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 We can get a lot of alcohol in the town we're going to. Are you proposing alcohol later instead of alcohol right now? Like, I'm proposing more alcohol later instead of this weird alcohol inside a trap that probably is going to kill us all. I have to protect my best customer. It's what I would do if I had us all. And Cleanse has to protect me because. <laughs> 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 Okay, I'm going to follow you guys, but Come I need on. to tell you this is a trap. This is obviously a trap. No, it's fine. If it's fun, it's not a trap. The, the thing is to enjoy it's a fun the time trap. and Definitely. then to get more out of it. You just have to ask yourself. Yeah. Spark joy. What was that? That was a cat. Do you have a cat? <laughs> Anyway, okay, so as you sort of follow them mysteriously, they just seem to melt away in the mist, and hey. uh, you guys find yourself in a marsh. Oh, no. Uh, Where's our car? Did, did Cleanse oh, happen to bring out our clothes, or are we just naked in a marsh? No, I have the clothes. I have the clothes and all the belongings, but I don't have the, the horse. I don't know where is the horse. MP did not take off her clothes. Where's Red? Is Red just like skipped out with the card? No, no, no. I, I was with them when they said alcohol. <laughs> okay, so why, why is the card like flying away? <laughs> That's not me. <laughs> I don't know. Somebody had okay. But okay. if they didn't say alcohol, that would have been what the uh, results were. <laughs> Could the you horse, guys... Animal handling, horse, stay in one place. We'll get you later. <laughs> yeah. Please stop bouncing that icon around. It's making me dizzy. At that point, you find yourself in this marsh. They've just sort of disappeared away from you. And uh, there's this really, really ugly woman. Oh. <laughs> and she's like, hello, children. Hello, grandma. Hello, Miss Thatcher. Good evening, lady. What are you doing in my marsh? We what were in up, buddy. Not Your now. marsh? We were my... coerced by druids. <laughs> Spoilers. <laughs> <laughs> oh snap! That is a that's a pretty big spoiler. Let's just go ahead and do that now. Turn order. Why is that? Oh, I don't know, children. Why would we have to an order? Maybe you want to roll initiative. <laughs> Fuck. Can I get a character sheet? I'm not sure how to bring one in. Uh, you have to type it in yourself. There's a yeah, thing. it's a bit of a pain in the butt, so just do it from... Yeah, you can do it manually. Just do it like... <laughs> I was just about to add the old lady her name. Uh, actually, Ooh. maybe if I just do this, give me one moment. If I share, oh, what do no, this? You just have to enter your data on the character sheet and then yeah. click the button on the character yeah, sheet. Yeah, I, I don't, I don't, I don't even know where to click on the character. That's the yeah. It takes a while. It took me like two weeks. So. Ooh, damn. Um, okay, mm -hmm. what if I just share my screen instead? That might be easier. No, uh, you, right. you can use the roll tool. Um, on the left side, okay. there's like five little buttons, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, one of them looks like a D20 that oh, opens the dice roller. Because I'm not, I don't kind of bring up the video anyways, that's why I was planning to just... Wait, is this it? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
that. Yeah, you you click on the dice roller, and you can pick D4, D6, D8, D20, and then you just roll. So you can just type slash R uh, space uh, the amount D yeah. the dice plus whatever. I'll do it. I'll do it the manual way. Why not? Slash R D20. Boom, like that. But the creature rolled twenty. Yep. Uh, but she might have got more than that. Oh, oh yeah, she, she rolled. Oh my god. It, she's really ugly. She's not like a drow, right? Oops, she got one now because I missed her. <laughs> she looks like a drow. No, yeah, she got a one. She got a one. No, she looks like a grotesque, ugly, um, horrible. Um, I got a twenty. Woman. Oh, nice. Nice. So red will be saving us. <laughs> After this thing, yeah. so red, you charge and we run away. Yeah, you pick up my. <laughs> yeah. What's the range and the crew, cloud right? kill? Welcome to the crew. You you can sort everything out, Chris. Uh, okay, okay. So, MP... so for the purpose of this, we will pretend I'm going to thirty change... miles away. Okay, I'm going to change the uh, the uh, scale now. Arbitrarily to five feet per square. Okay, for the purpose of this fight. Okay. Okay. Oh. She says. Can you bring me the that it is? What the fuck? Huh. I have a green zebra. <laughs> oh, the ugly old woman cackles. <laughs> And she looks at you all, and she goes, how many of you are there? One, two, three, four. Five. There's five of us. It's a very not easy on... number. Why, why, why is somebody not on the board? Well, no, we're all in the board. No, we are. All it's red. Red, ah, red, red is red on the board. Not the... Oh, it's not in the turn oh. order. Oh, oh, yeah, it's not because the red turn. doesn't have the character sheet. He rolled a yeah, 20. Okay, okay, I'll repeat. Okay, um, John can manually add him. You got a 20, yeah, right? Yes. Right. Okay. Yes. I can't seem to add your name. Anyway. There you go. There you go. Uh, you add your name? No, it's going to... Okay. So, it looks at the five of you, and it says... It says, just the two of them. <laughs> She's a bard. She looks at MPC and she points her finger. And oops. Ooh. Yeah. Uh, oh, does a twenty-one hit you? NPC. Um, I mean, if it's against armor class, uh, make a range spell attack against it, and I hit the target. Takes up and say, "Yeah, I guess it's against the armor class." I guess it's like a ranged attack because it's like a magical ball of light. Yeah, well, it's a black, horrible ray. Okay. I'm guessing that everyone has gloves. It's now, okay. Right? I'm immune for all magical damage because I don't have a soul. No, you're immune to charm <laughs> persuasion because you don't have a soul. Nope, all no. magical damage. Nope. Oh. Nope, I said charm <laughs> persuasion. Yes, no. but I mean, you can back that up with data, but who are you going to believe? An email that's visible or me? <laughs> oh, me. Yeah, me. Believe me, I, I'm the biggest. I'm the best character. <laughs> okay. I'm at the best art. <laughs> And you feel all your strength draining away from you. 
Uh, all ten of it. Uh, yeah, you don't have any strength, anyways. <laughs> you have been enfeebled. Oh no, my stats probably remain the same. <laughs> <laughs> so at the end of your turn, you can make a Constitution saving throw against this spell, which you're going to need to make a DC 13 at the end yeah. of so your the, turn. But for now, what you are enfeebled. What, what does it do? Myself. It just drains away all her strength, so all her, when any attack she makes is a half damage. Oh, mm -hmm. oh even if it's a dex? Um, let's see. That's a good question. Um, it's a dex based by baby. Maybe. No, but use strength until the spell ends. So if it's a dexterity attack, you're fine. Black beam, not a ball. Black beam of energy springs forward. Black beam energy on a hit target deals only half damage with weapons attacks that use yeah. strength. Ha! Huh. Yeah. You're fine. <laughs> and he's <laughs> literally unaffected. You're fine. <laughs> My stupid ass character finally came. It came <laughs> That'd be, be, be fine. <laughs> now, if you attacked Charisma, I'd be fucked. <laughs> Okay, so that's her, and she sort of said, yeah, come into my swamp, little girl. <laughs> and there's all that. <sighs> Told so Red, immune. Red, your new friends are in trouble. What are you going to do? Where's the bitch? I mean, the witch? <laughs> um, she's... What color is the witch? Hag colored? Yeah, black. I can't even see you on the screen. Stay out of my swamp, you kids. <laughs> um, guess I'll swing at her with my long sword. Yeah. Oh, thank God you said sword. So you're gonna go into the marsh? Where are you? You're gonna have to move up to her then. Or is, oh, is that her? Yeah, that's her. Okay, okay, so you step into the marsh in your chain mail. So mm. that's now difficult terrain and you're sinking. Probably can only get to that second square there. Yeah, One, you're like two, slop, three, four, slop. five. Shalop, shalop, shalop. So probably you made it. Uh, Theatre, so half movement, your movement swaps, so that's 5, 10, 15, yeah, you can make five. it there. 25, so what, 10, 5, 10, 15, you could just about make it, you could just about make it at a stretch. Just make it there? You right. could just about make it close enough to her to, right. uh, to take a swing at the bat. If you really mess up on your attack roll, you're going to fall on your face in the marsh. Oh, no. Oh. I don't think I can, though, but I'll give a shot. Uh, I am going to roll 1d10. Oh, wait. Plus 7. So roll d20 plus 7. Mm -hmm. I rolled a 3. <laughs> 10. That's a 10. Okay. Can you roll me a dexterity saving throw? <laughs> Uh, dexterity saving throw, so that's a plus one. That's eight. an eight. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear, you just fall like on your face in the marsh and then you like <laughs> flail in it with your sword, you're like, Aah! and you're like laying in the marsh with your face in it. <laughs> Cleanse. Well, this woman saw... is incredibly evil. Yeah, yeah, I, I can see it. So I see what happens to Red, but I'm going to try to do the same. If I stand here, can I yep. reach easily? You can yeah, stand yeah. over Red, so you don't yeah. see. Yeah, you, you don't have to go into that. <laughs> okay, so I am I'm now to... a plank. I'm going to try my horse feet. Sorry, I put it in the, in the opposite way. Um, and I think it hit. A 19 hits. Uh, oh, yeah. So the first is taking six damage. Mm -hmm. 
and the second attack is 12 to hit? 12 misses. Okay, so the second misses. That is terrifying. Okay. So, NPC. <laughs> Feeling I very feeble. I am very cross <laughs> about being enfeebled when I was already weak to begin with. <laughs> So I am going to one, two, three, four. Is it difficult terrain with no armor? Yep. But you're but, an elf. Yeah. And you're quite you're quite sort of um I'm very skinny, angry. You, you could yeah, you're say also I'm quite skinny. Dropping you, a rage. But you did grow up in the city, didn't you? You're not really a nature person, are you? But I am a high elf and I've been around for three hundred years. I've been in the sewers before. I know how okay. a marsh works. You know how a marsh works. You've been around Legolas, the block a bit, what girl. do your elf feet walk on? <laughs> all right. So You've been around the block a few times. I'm just going to try something here. This might all go crazy, but I'm just going to see if I can extend the map out. Uh, I'm going to oh. shank this hag yeah, twice. Okay, Does go 16 ahead. I'm just... hit? I'll do it a minute. I'm going to add a bit more there. That's it. There's a 16 hit. Um, no, it doesn't. 22 hit? Yep, it does. Then, oh, that's the wrong button. There we go. I'm raging. Bonus damage plus two. Nine damage. Dexterity, not enfeebled. Okay, you do nine damage on her. It's Ouch. weak, but it's fast. Ouch, he says. Prison rules. <laughs> and she sort of like, ow, 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 naughty girl. Ow, ow. But it's not much, but it's honest work. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Uh, next we have Theba. I believe you're naked, Theba. I'm naked. I mean, I'm just uh, have uh, bagpipes. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna look around. I'm gonna look at the fog and look at the lady, and I'm gonna say, "Oh damn, lady, you're so ugly that Forrest had to get some fog to not see you and cast Peter Smokery on her." <laughs> uh, wisdom fourteen save, which she makes. Oh, and nothing that reminds me. And she's like, "Yes, I'm ugly." Actually, She's no, got I'm a small winky. <laughs> hey, it's, cold, lady. it's cold. It's cold. <laughs> There's considerable shrinkage. <laughs> uh, and I'm gonna go towards Cleanse, who I guess has my stuff. Mm -hmm. Just do my full, my movement towards her and attempt to take it. Which I'm gonna guess I'm gonna spend my next turn putting it on. Putting on, starting to cover up your. No embarrassment. Jalina. <laughs> My adequate okay. side. I think Dana is also naked, no? Yep. I'll cast this spell. Minute Meteors as an action. Mm -hmm. As bonus action, I'll let loose two of the Meteors, or whatever it's called, Tiny Meteors. And I'll need to try to hit this lady. Mm. How much do I have? Plus whatever. Plus seven, okay. So it's two meteors going against her. Mm. Does a 16 hit? No. No, it doesn't. Okay. That's what I got. She didn't work. But don't you get multiple meteors, or is that one? Yeah, okay. two. Yeah. yeah, so there's the first one doesn't hit, goes wide. Second one hits. All right. She will get a measly 2d6. Nine points of fire damage. Ooh. And I'll also hopefully have my robes on me or whatever, my swimwear. I'll move back a bit, and my next section will be to dress. 
<laughs> okay. That's why you did a good makeup. Uh, we're back to the top of the round. And, um, the, the, uh, the, uh, ooh, that's MPC behind her. Oh, a target rich environment. And, uh, what happens is she disappears away from you. Yeah. Uh, fireball. Oh, no. Well, I wanted to fireball her, but... <laughs> no, we are getting a fireball. Ah, that's fine. I have a of fire. Okay, she I just disappears. Okay. We won. Level up. <laughs> I like how Barrett sings it in the remake. Yeah, he does. It's yeah, the only so, way we can hear it now. Red, what are you doing? You're laying face flat in the mud. I did it up. Uh, I move over here. Mm -hmm. Hey, no peeking. <laughs> and then perception check. Okay, roll perception. I'm just going to do it here. It's like much easier. Uh, that's a 12. Uh, yeah, there's this like kind of kind of hot, kind of sorceress kind of chick getting dressed near you, and you're a dwarf, kind of making you a bit kind of taller. <laughs> taller, yeah. You're like, well, I'm glad I woke up in that card. <laughs> but other than that, you're not. But, um, aware do of I see any footprints going slush slush in the mud? You don't see footprints going slush slush in the mud. No, you don't. Um, I will... Good call, good call, oh, but no. Time. Okay, so you're just ready, and if you see an ugly woman, you're going to smack her. Yep, I'm going to go pegging if I have to my uh, longsword at him. <laughs> okay. Okay, cleanse. Mm. Same, this woman just disappeared like... <laughs> okay, if I use Divine Sense, I can sense anything affected by the spell. I know the location of any... I oh, know, but this will be Celestial Fiend that earned that. Mm, well, at least can I detect good and evil? <laughs> can I detect good and evil around me? You can detect there's still something evil around, around but you're not sure. It's like kind of a distant echo of evil just on the other side of, uh, just on the other side of uh, reality. Somewhere in your nightmares, maybe. Okay. So I tell the others, she's still around, but not exactly here. Be, pre be prepared in case she comes back. And I cast, cast to I don't know, level one to NPC. Mm -hmm. you blessed. NPC, you're blessed. Nice. You can only so bless one person? Um, level one, yes. No, you can do free. And that what? <laughs> oh yeah, free. Okay, so I have people around me, so it's NPC, Tiber, and I can get Lina too. Sorry, Red, you're too far. <laughs> no, <I'm blessed. laughs> oh, cool. Also, you kind of not trust. Three, you three are blessed. Okay. Hey. NPC. Smack myself in the face. I was all back to me already. That was quick. <laughs> Smack your face. <laughs> Yeah, otherwise um, you would drop your rage. I'm gonna steal. Okay, I hit half of the strength damage from an unarmed attack. Yeah, but you're zero. Yeah, yeah, but you are so... enfeebled, so. What yeah. are you trying to hit? Myself. Yourself. In the face. Yeah. Why? Because I'm. You don't have all to hit. How <laughs> to keep yourself raging? Oh my god. No, gosh. that would be meta gaming. I'm in character. Okay. I'm a rage You do the slap, you do the oh dear me, poor Kimura Hana son. You do the slap yourself around the face thing. Yep. Okay, and we'll have that one in memory of poor Kimura Hana san. That was pretty bloody sad. Let's go. Oh, crying shame. Anyway, um, so okay. Theba, the ugly uh -huh. woman has disappeared. 
I'm gonna go to cleanse and try to take all my clothes and put them on and my weapons and stuff. Yeah, yeah, while cleaning. Okay. So you currently in six seconds are trying to get dressed. So do uh, as much as I can. So I can also do a. You're well, only like dexterity. <laughs> Roll me either dexterity or intelligence, either one, whichever's up to you. Yeah, that's gonna be dexterity. Both. Okay, you don't put both legs in the same like trousers and leg or anything <laughs> stupid. <laughs> but you, yeah, you, you start getting yourself dressed up pretty quickly. And the next oh, Lena. Uh yeah. I guess I roll next to the saving throw as well. For uh -huh. check. Right. Mm -hmm. Trying to speed dress. Uh, where is this thing? Is it a saving well that doesn't matter. All right. Lena's not doing so great. You kind of what do you normally wear, Lena? Do you normally wear robes and stuff? Uh huh. I or mean, you still, no, you I'm, like, yeah. I'm in my my swimwear. I'm just wondering if Blast gives me is Blast good for ability checks or something? Oh, it does. Yes. Saving throws, attack rolls. Ah, uh, but okay. not, no. Not, no ability checks. No ability checks. Yeah, okay. well then, no. Okay. So your swimwear, you're putting on your swimwear. Right? Yeah. So you're like fiddling around with your bikini top. Like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> you know how hard it is to put a bikini on? It's very hard. Yeah. I, I, I can it's imagine. It's not that hard. I need help. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Rich. Yes, yes, Chris will park that one there. Yeah. I've worn bikinis before. My chainmail bikini is still around here somewhere. Oh, God. <laughs> okay. Right. That's my turn. Okay, well, it's funny that somebody should have. Um, hold on a minute. It's funny somebody should keep clicking on that square. Uh, there we go. Okay. One. That one, that one. Bing! Little old lady appears right there. Oh. Bing! Can I use my? You're ready to action. If you yep. roll me, uh, just sort of dexterity to see how well you react to this. Mm, okay. Roll me a dexterity check, just because. Uh, eighteen. Wow! Yeah, give her a good old smack. I'm gonna smack yeah. her. Like my parents smack me. Is that meta gaming? No. <laughs> <laughs> Just the everyday household. Uh, okay. Seventeen. Oh, seventeen is what you need. Oh yes. You yes. Okay, and then I one D ten plus four. I'll do it in here. Why not? One D ten plus four. Ooh, 14. Oh, 14. Oh, shit. Oh, she felt that. Nice. Ow, she said. Am yeah. I able to use um, my second attack on her? Or was it just the uh, one? The reaction, I think. Um, as soon as you delay you. your action, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's say you can get it as soon as you hit it. Let's say you get a second one in, yeah. Great. So I'll do it again. Whoa. 25. Ouch. You smacking her around for eleven. Okay. Ouch. Not happy. Let's get the crap out of me. <laughs> <laughs> and because she's not happy, uh, she's gonna have a go at you as well. Uh, Okay, so she takes a swipe at you with her claws. Picking. Uh, That's a hard roll. Does a 13 hit you? No. Damn, her claws just rake against your armor. She's a bit annoyed. That's her go. Oof. And she says, as a free action, she says, Give me the bag. Give me the bag with the souls. I want the bag. I hold harder to I hold my barrel even, even harder. No, it's my barrel. 
Give me it. Give me it. I want it. I want the souls. I want the souls. Give me the souls. Give me the souls. Give me the lovely scrummy elf soul. Yum, 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 yum. I want it. I want it. Oh, God. Red, it's your go again. Oh, yes. Great. I eat my soul. I will swing at her again. 23. That hits. Great. And then I will... Um, how do I do this? I think I can use a superiority die for the attack. Mm -hmm. The mm -hmm. damage, was it? Mm -hmm. um, plus four, plus, uh, what do we do? D8, mm -hmm. I believe it was. Fourteen. Wow. She's taking a lot of hits. And then I go there. for my second attack. Whoa. 23. Coming up. And then I'll burn another one. Why not? Okay. <laughs> 15. Wow. Wow, you're beating her up. Something rotten. She's there. Uh... And then I will... Oh, what was it called again? Action surge? Oh, you want action surge? Oh, God. <laughs> just it's going to be over his toe. Wow. <laughs> it's just because you're good. I forgot fighters could fight. Oh, thank you, Tai Chi. She's asking for her. Thank you, Tai Chi. <laughs> thank you. Tai Chi, everyone's good. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, and then I'll swing with the uh, superiority die again. Mm -hmm. For 15. That misses. Oh, no, so that's for, for the damage. That's the damage, okay. Whoa. Well, she's still there. Uh, and I can get one final attack because of the um, action surge, was it correct? Okay. 18. That hits. And then I'll spend the last priority line. Why not? 21. Oh. Wow. That's exactly what you needed. <laughs> oh. Okay, fine. <laughs> oh, there's one dead hag laying on the floor. Does it have sisters? Oh, but you should mention that. <laughs> You want to have sisters? Uh, are they step sisters? Maybe they. Maybe she was part of a coven. Well, the coven's definitely weaker now, right? Yep. All right. Can I get dressed? Yeah, I'm gonna finish getting dressed and gonna be like, hey, where's that thing that we have to kill? Already that. I'm just friend. gonna go over there and finish the job. Just give me two like minutes. I'm, I'm just gonna go and grab a drink. I'll be back in a minute. Okay. Our new friend I'm is that very good. I killed her. Good job, Brad. Yeah, she just completely turned up on me, and I was like, holy crap, I did panic. And then next thing I knew, she was dead. Sorry, you laid it on her. Say that right. Good job, Brad. I think it was a vicious mockery. That's the thing that got most yeah. damage out of all. He you scared like her. Feeblement didn't affect my barbarian at all. <laughs> who's, who's the tall guy anyway? Tall guy? Yeah, the one with the beard. <laughs> He's not tall. Compared to you, he is. Oh, that's right. He's the tallest guy I know. <laughs> <sighs> I think you, you were asleep when we were making the introduction, so you don't know him. He's a new friend. A new friend? What's your name? Which one? You oh, me? I, I, you I know, I'm not the tall guy. I'm, I'm, I'm a dwarf. I'm anything but tall guy. He's a <laughs> yeah, I'm a halfling. <laughs> a, small <laughs> halfling. <laughs> a small halfling at, at that. So, <laughs> you're tall to me. Okay. I'm Black. red. I'm a mountain dwarf. Why are and, you red? Uh, 
Yeah, I was, I got I was getting tired with after exploring and so I went into the cart and fell asleep and then you guys showed up trying to take my cart away from me. Red, I have a very important question for you. Yeah. Do you wanna hear a song? Say no. <laughs> Is it the one we've been hearing the whole time? Yes. You know, it's very hard to know more than one song. It took me about a hundred years to it's learn not. this one. So if you know somebody that knows two songs, they're lying. So I'm going to play the same song again. Uh, bring out my pan flute and start playing the same song. <laughs> I'm not stopping. <laughs> but yeah, now you know, kind of know why I'm called Red. After uh, all that. Panic attack. After all that blood. Because <laughs> <laughs> like you're red, red now, I guess. Makes sense. So what you can see over on the other side of the marsh, you can see the road. You can see mm. a, a nice, very well-made, paved road up on the other side of the marsh. That's the victory road. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I want to go back for a horse, guys. Oh, yeah, that's I true. Check, I want to Let's check the back. corpse of the witch, yeah. if there's anything. Okay. Yeah. You find uh, some sort of disgusting, sort of unpleasant little items, and you find uh, you find a scroll. Scroll. Can I take a peek and see what the scroll is about? You can take a peek and see what the scroll is about. What languages do you speak? Common, Halfling, and Deep Scan. Mm, you can't read it. Is it Dwarvish? Can't read it. Is it Elvish? Uh, nope. I know. Ah, where are my languages? Is it Draconic? Huh? No. Wait, I don't know where it's in Hebrew. Maybe it's a guide, how to be ugly. We don't need that. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, how to not to take care of yourself. Yeah, how to take six hits straight from a dwarf and die. Yeah, and then die. <laughs> <laughs> the scroll. It's a saga. I know celestial, common, and infernal. Oh, you know infernal and celestial. Yeah, you know infernal. Oh, you can read, you're like, oh, you look at the soul, and it's like written in Infernal. The scroll is written in Infernal. What does it say? Are you going to read it? Not out loud. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Maybe the title. Does it say how to be ugly? No. It's some sort of scroll that we, you would use in a ritual for... Um, Stealing souls. Oh. Ah. Perfect. Hey guys, I know how to steal souls now. <laughs> yeah, me too. Look in this bag. No. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I don't need a scroll for that. If you read it backwards, maybe the souls will be unstolen. Oh, I don't think so. But... Freddy is the devil. Freddy is the devil. <laughs> it's like playing backwards. backwards. <laughs> yeah, it's a great idea. I think we should try it. Metagaming. John is the dead. A. Not you. John Lennon. John Lennon, eh? Yeah. Mm. That's, That's actually, a great yeah. idea. Metagaming. That's a brilliant idea. I wish I'd thought of that. <laughs> <laughs> in the scroll, does it mention anything about the bag of souls? No, it mentions things. Well, I mean, how much are you going to read? Like I'm going, I'm, I'm going to try to read how to make the ritual, but not out loud. So you like to sort loud. of squinting at it. It seems to be like some ugly thing about getting people and putting them on stones in circles and <laughs> <laughs> all kinds of really nasty <laughs> stuff. Oh. Okay, I think we were very lucky today. We need to stop dancing naked with other people at night. Ah, MP does not also. agree to this in principle, ah. but I believe for the nonce it is prudent. Yeah. Is that the only thing I found on the witch? The only thing of significance other than some sort of like horrible kind of disgusting remnants of what might have been people and things like fingers and pieces of hair and 
I'll take uh, all the the kind, and all yeah. the kind of stuff you might find under your bed. Back, uh, um, I have a futon, so you have a futon. <laughs> so disgusting hair from a witch. I'm gonna. So what are you gonna do? Is the horse like safe? We should go get the horse. The horse is just sort of standing there, munching at the grass, half asleep. Maybe I want to check the hut. Yeah, I'll come with you. Yeah, yeah. Let's, let's take a look at the hut. And Peter stagger over. Feeling hot, hot, hot. Let us check the hut. Okay. Okay, you go into the hut. It's a pretty sort of sparse affair. Stone walls, bit of a table. Is there anything of interest? Take a pass around, see if anything I can take. Oh, there's Maybe. like bedding rolls, there's bedding, there's kind of things hanging on the walls, various like kind of naturistic, mystic symbols, kind of stuff. Um, there's like uh, a few old books. So can anybody help me? I kind of want to mark this place as my own, but I used to it might be on the cards. So. You yeah. can make more P. Yeah, but it takes a while. I mean, the the dryads and the druids, they told us that we could spend the night in here. Well, yeah, what time is it? It's like morning? Well, it's you now, were... yeah, it's now like you've been on the go for quite a while now. You're pretty pooped. Yeah, Thanks. we should use this place, secure it, maybe. Okay, maybe we can take a rest in here and continue in the morning. I'm all for that. I suppose. Yeah, that's a spirit. <laughs> she doesn't have one. Yeah. So we can uh, do the plan we had before. Can the elves take shifts to look over us? Because we don't need to sleep as much. OK. OK, so we're going to take a rest in here. OK. Are you just going to leave the door open? <laughs> No, 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 no. Chilly. Close the door. Trust, trust the elves to take care of that. I'm just going to sleep. Mm -hmm. So tired of dancing. Okay, who's on watch? Who's going to take the first one? Well, last time I did such a good job. Probably I shouldn't. Okay, NPC, can you take the first one? Okay. All right, NPC, you'll be glad to know your watch passes without incident. That's nice. Second Hi. watch. I suppose Lena. Yeah. <laughs> I don't like John's face. Happened again. <laughs> Seriously. Lena, what are you doing while you're on the watch? <laughs> I am trancing. I'm, I'm outside <laughs> meditating. Yeah. Well, I'm meditating. Okay. Well, no, actually, no, because four hours, right? I'm, I'm fine. So yeah, I just, I just, I'm actually watching this time. You're actually watching. I'm actually watching. With my thirteen passive. Okay, can you roll me a, a perception check? Sure, I can. Will it be good? I don't know. Hey, it's the same as my passive. <laughs> okay. The rest of you in the in the in the cottage. So Lena's outside, and the rest of you in the cottage. Um, what's your passive perception? Inside the cottage. <laughs> yeah, the rest of you who are asleep. Eleven. Fourteen. Fourteen. Okay. 
Dina, can you roll me your perception again? Again? <laughs> yeah. Sure. Which number two? What number do I need to hit? <laughs> Mm -hmm. How about a 17? A 17? Can't you do it any better than a 17? <laughs> I mean, you want me to try again? <laughs> I mean, don't you have any kind of blessing now? You haven't got blessed anyway, you don't have any... Uh... Uh, well, you still have the bless. No, bless is gone. No, bless is gone. I'm going to say that just on a 17, you kind of didn't notice the, the uh, stealthy figure climbing out of the window. Okay. And uh, But you did sort of notice a stealthy figure making its way through the marsh. Well, yeah. But, you know, kind of in the distance. A bit. Guys, the witch is back! Wake up! Bye, witch. Yeah, the witch. She's back. I think there's another one, but... How many hours that passed? It was not that uh, long. We'll say you've had a full rest. This was right at the end of the watch, and we'll say okay. you're all pretty well rested, and it was kind of early in the morning. Ah. Wake up, my Tiba. Wake up. Yeah. Roll me investigation. Oh, shit. Two with a natural one. <laughs> hey, dude, we're a halfling. Oh, yeah, that's right. I'm a halfling. <laughs> Let me reroll that. 19. <laughs> uh, You're pretty sure you had that bag. You know that red bag with the souls in? Uh -oh. yeah. Guys, did somebody take the bag? No. Yes. Inside check. Then. That's a suspiciously open window. <laughs> If did uh -oh. anybody open the window and hide the bag because it was a joke? Uh -oh. I immediately go out and look at the distance. Lena, did you see someone? Yeah, yeah. Someone is coming from the from the marshes. Coming, but going from here. Somebody stopped. Yeah, from you saw them going through the marsh. Uh, going through the marsh. Yeah, yeah, going through the marsh. Okay, I start going, moving towards that direction. You can uh, see um, wait for me. one of them druids kind of on the other side of the marsh with the uh, bag. It's in uh, fireball range. Uh, well, um, yes. Oh, pity. <laughs> How far away is he? Well, we're going to we'll say that uh, it's a bit further than that. Okay, but how okay. far? What's the range on your fireball? That's 150. Oh, that'll reach. Yeah. <laughs> Will it? Yeah, 150 feet. Yeah, if, you, if you're serious, yeah, you, it's like, you know, that marsh is probably about 50, 60 feet across. So I've been messing okay. around with the scale. So. And it's probably gaseous, so everything's going to burn. Yeah, yeah methane. <laughs> wow. Methane over the place. Yeah, you can the stop marsh. marsh fires. All right. I guess I sent him a warning shot. Okay. What do you what do you do? Fireball. Is that a fireball? Fireball. That's a warning shot. That's just a warning start shot. You should see start what happens when they get there. You, start the days you mean to go on. I love the smell. <laughs> fireball in the morning. It smells like like but you don't surf. So you're gonna make it a dexterity like save, I guess. Forest fires. Yeah. 15. Fails. Fails. Well, la di da. Okay. Let's see. Uh, oh. Let me reroll those twos. So, it's 24. Uh, 3d6. Okay, that's 24 plus 11. Okay, that's uh, 35. Fire damage, and I also yell, "Stop! This is a warning shot." It's <laughs> <laughs> just this, like pair of, water. Stop resisting. This pair of hippie sandals just sort of standing slightly <laughs> under the side of the mark, and this is like smoke. It's like one of those actually like chink 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 chink. <laughs> I I want to jump out through the window and run as fast as I can. 
That's okay, you're, run the fireball. Yeah. you're running across the marsh. I lit okay. him up. You're going to have to roll dexterity as you run across the marsh. Way to. You skipped lightly across the marsh. I'm going to go with the corpses and try to see if the bag is there. You do find the bag and it seems undamaged by the fire. Mm -hmm. Got it, guys. Want to check me what's oh, inside? Yeah. Hold on. No, 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 no. <laughs> MP sinks into the mud. Well, look into it if all the souls are still there. Oh, the MP is getting stuck in the mud. It's okay, guys. I got this. <laughs> I kept her. It's no, yeah, I was going to say, is no one going to help her because <laughs> she's got something? <laughs> yeah. It's okay. I got this. Okay, you got this. It's okay. I got you. I got you. Thank you. Okay, I, I guess it's better if we keep moving. We are yeah. getting too much attention from people around us. Yeah, what do you see around. on the other side of the marsh? What do I see on the other side of the marsh? The road. You see the road. Uh, yeah, road. You see uh, the road. Which goes road? further. It goes further this way. Sorry, I just now have to. Uh, hold on a minute. Because I extended this one. Oh, okay, okay horsey. Let's go through the marsh. <laughs> you can take a horse through the marsh. No, 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 no. I think we go the long way around. Around, yeah. Uh, Poor horse. We should name him. Yeah. Okay. Uh -huh. It. It. Sausage. I have look. I have Sausage. Look. That's a good Perception name. check yeah. on the horse's gender. <laughs> <laughs> horse's gender. Wrong it's a gender. New, it's a gender neutral. Horse. It's a neutral. <laughs> <laughs> like Sausage work. What is his name? Now you're yeah, Tim the horse. Tim the horse. Tim the horse. Sure. Tim the horse, fine. It's uh, you want to name the horse. Oh. It actually self-identifies as a Pegasus, but unfortunately, oh. it doesn't have wings. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have good enough okay. animal handling to know that. You say it like the name work. will be Trapus. What? <laughs> Trapus. To Pegasus is the proper name. Terapis is the oh, oh, animal. Mm. Ah, right. oh, Chris, you are a fan of knowledge. Mm -hmm. I Ter am. It's Terapis. pretty useless, but it comes in handy with D&D. &D. Is that where we're going to? Okay, we're going uh, this I guess way. So. Terra. There we go. The horse's name is Terra. Terra? Wasn't it, Tim? Either way. Terra is good. He can be Teratim. Teratim. There we go. I like Teratim. <laughs> um, there's a tower there. There's a tower. Yep. You can see there's a tower if you if you proceed along in your cart. Uh, Theba, what are you doing? Are you just hanging out on the other side of the swamp like the badass uh, rebel you the, are? Is there a, like any remnants from the druid guy? Um, no, like that fireball, just like that was like overkill. But there is the bag, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, there was the bag. But anything Nothing. else that person possessed was, uh, we just went up in smoke, went up in the proverbial smoke. Mm -hmm. At least we know okay. we cannot burn the bag. Yeah, I'll take the bag and walk to meet them where they're crossing with the horse. Okay, so you start walking back along the road, and I guess well, where, where are you going? Are you go which way are you going? Back across the marsh or back along the road? Along the road. Okay, so you guys take the cart. Yeah, that's much further than that in reality, but we'll uh, blur over that. You guys want to? You, if you travel, you're going to arrive. You see, this is a pretty well-traveled road, and uh, you see this. Uh, there is this tower that's obviously there to guard the T-junction, and there are 
some armoured people guarding the T-junction, oh. looking at you as you come up the road, kind of expectantly. Uh. Is it really morning? It's the morning, yeah. It's the morning, which everyone Lathander loves the morning. So, I wake up very happy. Good, Good morning. morning. Now, morning, travellers. Ten gold pieces, please. Ten? Can yeah, I'll take that in a second. Well, can I have double? Yes, for the car. If you're going to travel along the road, this is a low road. What if we you. just... What if we just follow the road, but not on the road? <laughs> it's still 10 gold pieces. <laughs> uh, hey, Red, do you have any money? <laughs> no? Because I ain't got any. No, I, I, I got minus 50. I have 20. So the guy asks you where you're heading. Okay, Where are you heading? Uh, what was the name of the city? Kenham. 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 You're going to Kenham. 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 Yeah, we're going to our way to find some priests in Kenham. So he asks you what your business is. Oh, Souls. I'm, a, I'm a follower of Latander and I'm just going to show my new friends the new way there. His eyes start to glaze over. Uh -huh. Like he's heard all this before. Yeah, you're going to the temples, huh? Yes. Yeah, a lot of temples in Kenham. Yeah, right. It's a good place to go. Yeah, not so many priests. More temples than priests. Well, sometimes you just need to be in a temple and you can be the priest yourself. Yeah, or you can be the same priest in lots of temples. Yeah, I never get my head around that religion thing. Anyway, 10 gold pieces, please. Here you are. I gave them 10 gold pieces. Oh, thank you. Um, I'm going to get poor. How much do we start off with, actually? My is kind of... <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Alan, the, the bag has been the bag came from a lawyer's office, so it just sucked money out of them automatically. <laughs> yeah, we lost all yeah. our money. Yeah, I'm in, in the very high Is negatives. It 10 gold pieces each or 10 gold pieces for the party? For the cart, right? Yeah, for the cart. Oh, okay. Oh, okay, that'll be fine. Uh, do you have any MP, advice? MP have advice for the shambles up to them. Mm hmm. <laughs> It's kind of an emergency. Maybe you can give those 10 gold pieces back because we really need them. I don't have a soul. <laughs> you wouldn't like to lose your soul, would you? We need to. Can you persuasion yeah. or something for that? <laughs> Oddly enough, this guy with the yellow helmet on is a bit of a wimp. He's like, um, what? Pun? You don't. Eh? So? What? Who? Yeah, I lost my soul. It's happened to a couple people around us since. It's going to happen again. I feel it. We says, need to see a priest. Could, we might need that 10 gold. Could you just give us a pass? He's like, um, you, you, by the way, NPC, you've worked in bars enough to know like nobility when you see it. This guy is one of those sort of pompous noble guys with the... Uh, yeah, he's got his armed men with him, but he himself isn't up for much, and he's kind of scared of you. Is there a bulletin board in here? It's okay. I don't really need the ten a gold. Bulletin board, Just I don't give think so. MP a hug. He said, "Okay, I can let you go for five. That sounds fair. If we come back this way, and I have my soul, I'll give you some more." Okay. okay and I just have a little hug. Aww. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> Very sweet. Can, can you tell us, just if we are going to the right direction? Yeah, Kenham, he says, Kenham's that way, and he points over to the 
east. Yeah. There's a sign that says, like, Kenan. Okay. Thank you. Thank you very much. Okay. You're so, so you set up along the road. Bing. Bing. Oh. oh, the castle. Fancy. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Yeah, I'm just having fun this weekend. Okay. So you're going to arrive over here. Yeah. 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 Okay. Okay, so you made it over to Kenham and oh, we've got two leaners again. Oh, it's, yeah, tai -Chi's, it's Tai Chi's bedtime, so we're gonna have to call it a day. All right, we'll call it the night, Bye. guys. All right, okay, thanks for the Good night, Tai Chi. Thank thanks for hanging out. Thanks for hanging out, everyone. Again. Good to see you all. Good to see you again, Alan. See you too. All right, I'll see you guys next week. See ya. Have a nice week. Peace. And you guys have a nice one. Right now.